Hey everybody, I'm Axel Grave, back with more reactions with the next. As always, remember to support the original content creator by using the links on screen and in the description below. If you'd like to support our channel, use the info at the end of this video to like, comment, subscribe, follow, join our Discord, or become a patron at patreon.com slash 3D. Thanks for listening to my boring spiel and I hope you enjoyed the video. Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Axel Grave, back with more reactions with an X and I am super happy to continue on our Jujutsu Kaisen journey. Things are popping off, heating up. Things are getting more and more interesting as time goes on, as with most anime series. Uh, I'm enjoying it. I can't wait to catch up to where things are at right now because everybody's like hyped about it. And obviously, I'm also trying to catch up because once I catch up to the anime, I'll have no choice but to read the manga, which I've been putting off for quite a while. I usually don't read manga until I get pretty far in. And Jujutsu Kaisen is now pretty far in for most people me i usually like 50 to 100 chapters before i even start a manga um but it just depends some i've, I've obviously that's not a hard rule that's just like what i start with because i like to have a lot to read and it also depends on if they're finished if they only got 20 then i you know anyway blah blah, blah. you guys don't want to hear the bullshit you're gonna hear about jujutsu kaisen i'm super excited uh last time we had soul bro versus crit by sorry i'm still bad with names um but yeah, we had a dude with scars who is a soul manipulator. I'm gonna call him Mini Adam, Mini Adam Warlock. Now nah, he's I know he's got his own name and he's the main villain of the story. I shouldn't shouldn't diminish his soul character, you know, his his individuality. Uh, and then in addition to that, uh, we got uh, our secondary teacher Gojo Senpai's homie. Uh, uh, I don't know his name, but he has that credibility, and it looks like he's probably got ability to do with overtime going over his work limit or something else i still i'm hoping I, to god he either loses badly or dies and i hate to say it like that because i like his character a lot like i really like his character the dude who's uh the the secondary teacher but as the villain he needs to show up and show out he needs to show that he is a threat uh and a big bad and as much as cunning and stuff goes like to win, obviously, if he uses cunning to win, that's a whole nother thing. But, like, you got to be able to... You have to have power in a story, right? Or at least, whether it be political, manipulative power, or pure physical power, or mental power, whatever it is, the power to make your will come true as a villain. So I, I'm hoping... And it looks like he does. I'm, I'm excited for it. That's what I'm expecting. So we'll see how this episode goes. I'm expecting there to be a really good fight, but for eventually that guy to win and either... It would suck for to see him take him, and I'll probably that would give me a good reason to not like him. That would be very good story writing. That's why I kind of expect it. Um, but maybe they'll surprise me and pop off with something else. Anyway, uh, I try not to do too much of long intros because I know I have my little intro bar, and I know you guys want to watch the series. But I also like to talk with you about the series when I get real into them and I start getting into them. Um, and I'm hoping that you guys are enjoying watching these because I'm really enjoying it. I don't all I usually don't get to watch an anime where I haven't read the manga first. So this is why I'm doing it like this. And I'm it's fresh. It's powerful. It's cool. Obviously has great animation. Um, although I really don't feel like that was displayed as much in this last one. I mean, it had good stuff, but I didn't. It, it wasn't like Gojo Senpai, Senpai's fight where I was just like, damn, look at that. That art. You know what I mean? Anyway, uh, we're going to get into this episode. It's episode 11 uh narrow-minded let's see how it goes i have no clue just be clear so this is flashback which i usually don't get down with <clears throat> but it's not that big i'm guessing <clears throat> over time time base packed Even still, we got to get some real heavy levels. Of seven to
You probably should have. Smart. All right, that's worthwhile. That's better. I can accept that. I can accept that he ran. That's, you know, another alternative. So I am surprised. That was good. Good writing. I love being surprised, bro. I love being wrong, honestly. Especially on shit like this, because... Ooh, this looks like a new intro, but I'm not looking at it. Narrow-minded. Nope. I don't know if it's technically not and technically is lying. It's weird. He's a very loose style of speaking. Mm. And there's that guy. So is the other guy a curse that looks human and that guy is a human that looks that has curse powers? <laughs> Why'd you go so far? No, they watched a lot a lot. Right, he, he's, he's an energy monster. Yeah. Heroes. No, 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 geez. <laughs> Except for, uh, in, uh, Black Noir. Damn nuts. Hey, look at him! He's a worm! Or a snake! So physical damage doesn't hurt him. Good to know. I like the way that the cage is like pulsating the red along those lines. The numb. <laughs> Poor dude. The Nami. Seems like a bigger scene than it's going to come up later, isn't it? The blood that he left there. Here, do something funny, please. That's nice. So there must be something wrong.
He is right about that. Something's going wrong. Oh, no, I knew it. Although I don't know who this is or why they're there. No real idea at all. I guess is what's his boy sent something? That or it's accidentally being done by what's the other guy, but they have a finger, so. Second left arm, so she died. Damn. Who the f was it? Was it him? I feel like we didn't get a lot of lead up to that unless it was actually the evil guys framing someone. Or something else. Oh shit, he's gonna kill the whole school? Okay, he has the main expansion now. Oh man, it's about to get into some big shit. Okay, so they did put it there. I'm sure it won't be for them. So they just blaming whoever? Weird. I guess now he's super strong. Yeah, that's why it's the weaker manipulated. But then how did he get in? weird so i guess it's just like one of those things where you need zero training and zero thing is someone just gives you powers you're powerful uh which i mean i'm not always against oh no 
No, we get a dumb. Is that like a what the? Is that a filler episode or just a seasonal episode? What the fuck? Whatever. Or maybe it's just like trying to throw me off with this random bullshit. I don't know. They've been doing a good job surprising me for four, though, so they did a good job at the start of this surprising me with the whole escape as opposed to defeat on either side. I still feel like it's rough because it's at least showing us this guy's growing, but we have zero idea of how strong our enemies are. And so far, it seems like everyone's afraid of Gojo, so it's not as threatening when your guy has the strongest guy on the field. Um, is the strongest guy on the field. Even if there are other things that obviously being the strongest doesn't always mean you win right uh by the you know because the world requires extra stuff this episode was pretty good yeah i mean i won't go into it too much i i enjoy this but uh i have a feeling i probably don't enjoy it as much as a lot of people want me to enjoy it uh having said that it's still fun uh, you know, this was episode 11. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it with me. I'm definitely enjoying the series enough to keep watching it. It's not, I'm not dropping it yet. And then they got a New Year's special. Interesting. Probably not going to watch that. There must have been something in between because this one's to you someday. It's not what this was saying, which was saying. She made for flavor. The tones of autumn disappear together with the tears of the beloved. Bloody autumn leaf viewing. Weird. All right. But that's not what the next episode's called. It's called To You Someday. You can see it if you go to Country Roll, at least according to this. So I don't know. But whatever. I'm glad that it's not because I didn't want some random filler episode. <laughs> anyway, guys, I hope you like the Remember to support the original content. We'll catch you next time. On reactions for the next Jujutsu Kaisen later. If you enjoyed watching or want to support the channel, remember to attack that like button. Subscribe on YouTube, follow on Twitch, or join our Discord using the link on screen or in the description below so that you can get daily updates on all of our uploads and live streams. We know we're not perfect and we can always improve, so please visit our Discord or comment below with a critique or a compliment to let us know how we can improve ourselves. Finally, if you're just starting for more content, you can become an honorary member of 3D Productions at patreon.com slash 3D and get exclusive access for as low as a dollar a month. This will also give you early access to all of our online content, including comics, gaming, music, and of course more of these reactions. Even if you're not able to do any of this, it means the world to me that you'd sit down and watch my video all the way through to the end. So I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. I'm Axel Grave, and I hope to see you next time for more reactions with the next.